what up y'all it's tommy and today we're gonna talk about the journey man and what i mean by that is i'm talking about the journey we call life everybody's on their own path everybody's on their own journey man and uh i think it's i think it's important that we keep that in mind i, I can't stress that enough that it's a long journey man and we can't let the details of everyday mishaps and bullshit that we all go through interrupt our energy in our positivity in our our journey right and so basically reason i'm coming out here saying this is like a couple weeks ago i was on top of the world man i was working out every day killing the gym just feeling on top of the world man and life's a roller coaster we're gonna have our ups and downs i don't know what it was what happened but i started slipping in the gym a little bit i started eating out a lot and uh you know i don't know exactly what it was but it was getting to me i was kind of depressed and coming down on myself and just not didn't have the same energy anymore man i let it phase me too hard but right now two weeks later i'm back in the gym i had an awesome workout today i feel amazing and my energy's back and my positivity's back for some reason i let whatever it was affect me and take everything my whole line of sight at that time i just let it ruin all that shit so basically what i'm coming out here saying is that don't let the little shit of the day to day phase you. Don't let one day missing reading your book or writing down your goals or whatever it seem like it's the end of the world. It's not. That's just one day of this journey, man. And if you just stay on track, keep your eye on the long run, the big picture, everything's going to be all right. We're going to move right past this. So, um, just trying to spread some love out there, let y'all know, you know, you ain't alone. Everybody deals with the day to day shit. And so just keep your eye on that big picture. Keep your goals in mind. Keep focused. Keep persevering. And uh, everything's going to pay off. So go vegan. You know what it is Vegan Squad! Look at how cool this tunnel is, man. This whole park, this whole area is just awesome. I'm gonna show y'all what's up. And the courtyard over here, some stairs. Oh god. My favorite part. Eagle up there. Cool man. They got this awesome bridge over there. I don't know if you can see it, but it's right over the water and the river. I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna set the hammock up over there. Kick it. Man, it's gonna be a nice little spot. All right, we're gonna get some speed here. So yeah, man, it was a good 4th of July. I went to uh, a couple vegan joints, went to uh, Pizza Nia for the first time. They didn't even have no vegan cheese, man. That shit was crazy, I couldn't believe it, but it was pretty good anyways. I was a no cheese kind of guy when I first went vegan anyways, so. It's still pretty good with no cheese on there. And uh, we went to uh, Sebastian Joe's, I think it's called. Ice cream joint. Which, they were packed, man. We had to wait like 15 minutes, like 20 minutes, man, just to get a scoop of ice cream. And uh, they only had like three vegan options or something like that. Had the blueberry... Whatever the blueberry something that tasted like, kind of tasted like some blueberry cheesecake ice cream, which is pretty good. I had to eat two of those shits because the person I was with couldn't finish hers. <laughs> so I was real full by the time I left there. Anyways, it was pretty good, man. Love places that have the vegan options because it's only getting more popular. You gotta get with it. I'll get lost, man. Straight up. Damn, they got some whole gaming shits going on over there. Oh shit. You know what it is, man. A vegan squad out here. Got the hat on. Representing that shit. Getting my workout in. The sick ass spot that I just found. Yeah, 
It's all flooded out down here, man. The water's super high, that river's super high. It's crazy, nothing but rain here, nothing but rain. Anyways, hope y'all have a good day. Just spreading some love. You know what it is, Vegan Squad.